Once gorillas came to school and said, Give us the banana. There was a banana plantation underneath the school where they grew banana trees. Anyway, it was then the gorillas ran to the school and trains. We all got up and got inside as fast as we could. So this boy, Ricky, stuffs a great big table in front of the door and he said, Watch out, everybody. Gorillas are really dangerous, you know. So everyone said, We know that, you stupid tomato fucker. Hmm. So this gorilla called Stevie made a banana, shoves his fist into the door really hard and fast. Slam! Ricky, hiding behind the door, got it right on the nose. There was blood. Oh, yeah, yeah. Loads of blood. Ooh. Anyway, Ricky was dead. That's a shame. There we all were, running like mad. It's no good. The gorillas were too fast and too furious. You'd hear kids going down behind you. Kaboom! Banner dead. Kaboom! Jack dead. And it went on for ages. Kaboom! 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 So I was hiding in the corner of the hallway. They're all shaky and shuddery, waiting for the horror to end. It was then the coolest teacher in our school appeared. He had an afro and he said, All right, do this art. It's over. Yeah. And he took this gorilla mask and he said, Hey, Stevie, made banana. I made a mask off your brother's big face. Yeah, if you don't want to get a mask off your no. big face, fuck off really fast. Okay, yeah. And off they go. And everything was lovely once again. Wonderful. And suddenly one day, our teacher, Miss Useless Bitch, said there was an inspector coming in. He was going to inspect my banana. <laughs> I mean, he was going to inspect the banana plantation underneath the school. Later that day, he came in, he had a moustache, and he said, Hello, I'm the inspector. And off we go to the banana plantation. There we all were, breathing very, very quietly. The banana door opened. Really good, said the inspector. We all went down the stairs into the banana plantation underneath the school. It was huge. Stop right there. Said so banana plantation guard, where do you think you're trying to go? I'm just a little inspector. He said, fair enough. Said so banana guard, and in we go. And he looked at our bananas. Hmm. And then our other banana. Hmm. And he said, what do they eat? There was silence. No one knew. And he said, that's really dangerous, you know. Not eating your bananas properly. They may go bad and mutate and murder all the kids at school. Blimey. Our teacher frowned and said, What do they want then? Goldfish, said the inspector. Oh, yeah, yeah. Okay then, class, we're off to get some goldfishies. And off we go. I was just about to be the last person to leave when I saw something else. It was then I noticed the inspector. He was stuffing hundreds of bananas into the crate. Hundreds and hundreds of them. So I went to get help. Not long after, I came back with the cool teacher, Mr. Cool Yo. By the time we got ourselves to the banana door, the inspector had gone. And suddenly we heard a terrible noise. There was an awful yelling and crying. There was the noise of hey, shit. So we went upstairs and I see the inspector murdering my teacher, Miss Useless Bitch. It was then Mr. Coolio pushed the inspector against the wall. And he removed his moustache. And it was Stevie Med Banana the Gorilla. <laughs> Mr. Coolio said, look at that. <laughs> Stevie Med Banana. I knew you would come back. Yeah. A new mask for my collection. Real good, bro. Stevie Med Banana said, I'm going to come back. I will. Mark my words. And Mr. Coolie Yoke said, Ha! Okay. And he pushed the gorilla out the window. Slam! We all went to the school and trains. And there was Stevie Med Banana, mouth open, eyes staring, banana stiff, dead on the floor. Mr. Coolie Yo took this gold knife out of his mouth row and began to cut off the gorilla face. And he said, Thanks, Nick. Dave said, That was completely bananas. <laughs> and I said, I wonder what is in those bananas. Kaboom, 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 kaboom. Kept on the plums.